Uh, Heath Smiley or Benno? Does Heath Smiley play Mark? I believe so. He's improving, actually. He's doing... He's actually... Um, cool. Yeah. It's good to see. That's actually fun. Like, I'm not... I'm used to, like, coming up and commentating and just, like... Singer Samus has been like, oh, beep boop, beep boop. I <laughs> have no idea what to like. I can't actually contribute to like. You're, you're there for the um, the play by play, less color comment. You're just there. Yeah. You're... Play by play is just, melee is just useless anyway. It is, yeah, no. It's, it's so like... annoying when you go on like streams in general and it just stays just sort of like a saying the moves. I, I, yeah. I've, actually, I've, I've been to like, like old Switch streams or whatever. Yeah. And they're just like. Be this slow, like, uh, like, like this really slow matchup. They're like, oh, bear, dare, sports smash. It's like, I, I, can't, I can see the screen. Like, it's very really annoying. I think it's very easy for people to um, treat it like radio, especially when they're like, if they're just having an off day in commentary or they're like newer to it, it's very easy to be like, well, yeah, what am I going to contribute? I guess if you like don't know like the the matchup and it's, there was like thousands of matchups in that game, you can't really like talk about it yeah um i think at a certain point you even need if you're not like if you don't have any expertise in the matchup you just need to like talk about your experiences with it maybe yeah. watching it and like or just like say it's like funny something you need to like say something don't be that person that just sits there for like says yeah, one thing every one person's like saying all the moves the one just sitting there like and they're just like i think it's cool to say like Moves and the unexpected, like you're like, oh wow, the yeah, no, the bear. but like re react, just, yeah. yeah, reacting and like it being a meaningful reaction is something, but like yeah. just being like, all right, and the peach without a bear going for the edge guard, it's like, come on, it's not radio. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm glad I've done that. I doubt in the past, especially my early commentary, I was like, all right, yeah, no, we're gonna. It's an easy thing to criticize. Yeah, it is. It's um, we've all been there. And you know what? People, when they're starting out on commentary, you shouldn't, you know, you should give them advice pointers, but it shouldn't be too harsh because most people, most people are terrible when they start out on commentary. And you know, what? most scenes need more people to step up and commentate. Just you know, sets, especially small scenes. Yeah. I know. I say we have like spots where it's like <laughs> when we get to because a lot of the people that do commentate are in like are our better players. You know, yeah. That will, like so we get to the spot where we're in like say top three, top four, whatever, and it's like. But who's who, who's left? Who's who are we gonna like wrangle? To yeah, comment? true. That's why I've done like a lot of your finals. I'm just sitting there like I don't know what's going on. Yeah, yeah. And then like me and Bell just say some random crap. It's pretty fun, <laughs> but like I love Catherine's love Catherine's like whole set. Like got the black beanie, the, like the black mask, the like black outfit, and she has a yeah, like it's very intimidating. Very yeah. The most intimidating five foot two smasher in SA. We have a lot of kids, eh? we have a lot of scary kids. Some spooky stuff, they kind of, you know. It's all match up, I just, uh, I, don't, I, I don't get it. Watching like Catherine just like, in like the cloud, just like do it. I'm just getting like, raw need every second, I'm like, oh. Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> I, don't, I really don't like this matchup personally, um, from my times playing Peach. I was comfortable enough, confident, but it's like, it just feels like you're chasing down this impossibly fast man who will, like playing by his beat and then you see yeah. Gaffrey just throwing out a death tech there. She just understands when Kale wants to go in. Yeah, yeah. I think for me I've just sort of like again with this matchup I'm just sort of like bugging out moves and Kale's reacting to me and then just punishing it. Mm. What's well, like other matchups I'm like Oh no No, yeah, yeah. That's, that's right I think up. she could have actually made it if she floated right after that yeah. um right after that. Okay, well we got the homie stuck. We got the, yeah, the unintentional homie side. You better believe inside he's like, God, fuck. God damn it. I had I had the lead, I had everything. Missing a couple of those actually. Yeah, look. Uncharacteristic. Turns out, turns out when um maybe we're just having an off day. Damn, maybe I should have I should have I should have taken a um a break. So the reason why I'm not actually entering. Yeah, yeah. Um go with that. So <laughs> all of yesterday I was actually helping my mom out, um there's a whole bunch of like random like old furniture that's in between the gates that had to be like removed eventually. So we hide out a skip bin, and um, obviously not all of that wouldn't have fit in there like by itself. Couldn't yeah. just like put them. So I ended up spending most of the day getting a sledgehammer and just like, breaking apart. Um, that's kind of funny. You know, it's it's actually like quite fun in a way. But it's maybe like the first hour. Yeah, eventually it starts becoming um 
just, you know, work. But got it done. But yeah, my hands are quite sore. So I was like, you know Fair what? Enough. I'm going to take a um, break. So, you know, sunburn on the back of my neck because I was an idiot and did not slip, slop, slap. It's always, it's always like the first time when it's hot, you like forget that it's going to exist. Yeah, and then you, a few hours later, you're just like, oh, damn. Yeah. Damn, I got... Okay. Well, Caleb's doing a good job to... Um, not full, not full. Uh, why do I the guy show up there? And he doesn't do it to Catherine. <laughs> like, fuck at that. Well, um, he's probably scared of Catherine, like yeah. out of shield or something. He's not very scared of me, clearly. No. Oh, that's uh, up any. Again, I, yeah, I completely just zoned out in the game with talking about your story. I've no idea what's going on. Well, I mean, look, I'm sure the Catherine people at winning. home. I'm sure the people at home. I'm sure the players playing this set would rather him about my. Yeah. <laughs> Oh no, that's it, I think. I'm assuming Catherine can, like, cover it. Yep, alright. That was interesting how she, like... I don't know, I felt like he could've... Caleb's the king of, like, buffering roll, right? And he just didn't do it there. Yeah. He, um, he wasn't, like, safe or anything. Maybe? I don't know, maybe he's scared of Catherine, like, waiting, cutting out that. But like, that's bot, like... I don't know. I don't think that's bot, um, the Peach is gonna, like... Like, last talk, I... Well... Wait, is Catherine the last dog? I think she was on last dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like at zero or something. Yeah. Like last dog, people aren't typically going to go for like hit shield weight as a read a lot of times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You could just like, got to mash it out. Hit shield. Because a lot of times people are going to just shield grab in the corner there. So you might as well go for like hitbox in the second hitbox. Um, if you're faster or like you just have like, you can also go for like say um, hitbox into dash away. Yeah. You know? That doesn't exist. It's hitbox into second hitbox, or it's um. Hitbox dash away is the last stock sort of situation, yeah. I think hitbox dash away can be last stock out. I, to be honest, at least with Fox, I'm sure like Peach, you can also feel like. Cause, I mean, Fox is obviously faster, but Peach shield pressure can be like Peach typically can get um safer on hit shield pressure than Fox. Yeah. Right. At least for the first hit, like you can get to like say plus two, yeah. plus three or four if you're very, very fast. Or not, well, yeah. yeah, if you like do a very low float aerial. Whereas Fox is typically at best getting like zero, and a lot of times getting like minus two, minus three. Sure. It's always weird like talking about like frames and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Where it's like, because like, like different to normal like fighting games, how like if you do like a minus two thing on shield, it's still like there's nothing to like punish it. Yeah. It's like different how that works, because you can like. Whereas like in other games, if you're like negative on shield or negative on like frames, you sort of like it's because um, there's like, less movement options to sort of like yeah like like dash back is a yeah. lot less um, powerful in a lot of other FG. Yeah, yeah, FG that's games. sort of what I was trying to get at. Yeah, a lot of times if you hit someone then you minus two, you're thinking to yourself, well, I guess I'm going I'm going to have to shield, I'm going to have to block yeah. because they're probably going to put out like something reasonably quick, you know, say a jab or something. And yeah, because they're like, they're, it's their turn or whatever. Yeah, it's their turn. You just accept it. Oh, that was really good movement by Captain. She just kind of holds forward a bit too long. Oh, knock down. Yeah, tech away. Sort of puts out a fair to like... Like, she went to put out that fair to cover tech in place, but she also put, sort of expected tech away, so she was veering forward. So you have she to like, always expect tech away. Yeah, you would, yeah. The thing is, if you react, like you can re still react to tech in, right? If they tech in, you have so much more time to react true, to it than true. tech away. So you oh, might as well. Yeah. Nice, good. Just covers ledge. No need to, you know, no need to put out in there or there. Just sometimes you just need to, you know, grab ledge and press L. A lot of people have issues at times with just, you know, doing the simple stuff. Yeah. Oh, okay. It scared me. Yeah, of course she um. Uh, she did like a double jump there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, me too. Yeah, it, I didn't hear the sound, but still, I still assume she did one. Mm. I did a few times actually where Catherine has done like like double jumped nares. Mm. It's just like, I mean, it doesn't really matter though in the scheme of things, but it's still like a, like a mistake, I guess. I actually have no idea what that is. Uh, oh, I probably changed the commentary thing. Oh. Actually, yeah. Um, what were we saying? Actually, what I was going to say beforehand was. Um, it was like a, a spot back there where Catherine just like then dashed away, and that was a good example of like just you yeah. know hitting shield and dashing away to like just, you know beat out the shield grab or whatever. But uh oh oh that caught the float. No, it didn't. Never mind. She didn't float. I thought she floated. I don't know. I just like in, in my set, like I just kept getting like 
hit by moves. Mm. And that's just like not happening here. Like, I don't know if the captain's like, yeah, like, ah, yeah, yeah. just a lot of things, obviously. Okay, doesn't go to a side plan. Both, like, like before, like, both players have a game plan and they're sort of reacting to, like, well, they have the game plan, they're sort of reacting to what the other person does and adjusting, as opposed to sort of, like... Then you feel like you're just putting out, like, a general... Yeah. You have a general game plan that's not really based on the player yeah. in this matchup, do you feel? More like, it's not based on the, like, situation. Okay, sure, yeah. Whereas, like, it's clear, like, when, like... Depending on where they are on the stage and what moves coming out, they both are like reacting accordingly. Mm. Which oh, this is great. This is potentially big. Oh, this is yeah, tech chase. Just puts out an air. I think that's yeah. The punish game with Falcon is so much harder unless you get like a really local center. Like, oh, that was a really clean. This instant up, instant landing up here. Yeah, I think you have that sort of thing as Falcon. You sort of like bung out the big moves, and if they're on 140, they just sort of die around. The yeah, onset that percentage is like, well, you just go up here. All right, Captain going straight to bot. Oh, it's it's hot OFD. These are both pretty good choices. Um, and the really understood the whole like matchup of this matchup, the stage of this matchup. Sorry, but, oh, yeah, like yeah. when I've heard people say about it, apparently like fod is like really awkward for like Falcon's like movement and stuff. The thing is, depending on platform heights, Peach can just kind of like sit under them. Yeah. And it's very hard for Falcon to actually um, get in. Apparently, a lot of the time, like, you sort of, like, move just, like, get, like, stuffed by the platforms. Yeah. Because, like, like, like... Yeah, it's... And, like, say this platform high right now, it's not uh, nowhere near as like, bad. Yeah. But um, once it gets lower, like, it's just so tricky. But yep. Basically, once, like, short hop near, or, like, you know, short hop approach um, gets stuffed out by the platform, it... You really just feel like that certain like that amount of the stage is cut off and you just have to like kind of meander around. Yep. And like That's when Fellow Falcon can start stomping. <laughs> that is the one thing you get on this stage is you get pretty cool stomps, but yeah. that's not you're losing more than you get, I think. Mean. Yeah, I mean that's, that's why a lot of a lot of Falcons don't well, opt to ban the stage or that OFD. Oh that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> the wrong, wrong move the end was cool. is the um, Peach Falcon chain grab doesn't actually go on for that way. It's still very brutal, but it's no, like, it doesn't feel quite as oppressive as um, yeah. Fox Falcon, or, or Fox Falco, because it doesn't go for as long, and um, since Falcon's heavier as well, if you, like, DI into center stage at the percent where you can get out, and, like, Peach has to nail or whatever, and you do get, say, up road nair, you're not getting sent anywhere as far. Whereas a lot of times, uh, you know, Fox or Falco's getting hit by a nair at, say, like, 90. Maybe setting up an edge guard situation. Like, okay, that's not gonna be it, but wins and repeat. I feel like both players could maybe like their. I mean, like, obviously, just this seems like the, the punish games are like super. I think they're both like, I don't know, like maybe a bit. Oh! That's, that's a punish game. I guess. <laughs> that's a punish? Okay, uh, I mean, that, that dash check was fine as a like yeah. react sort of thing, but it wasn't the best option. She definitely could have done a mare um, afterwards. But if you're not comfortable doing it and you just want to do the like fast, easy option, sure. Yeah, and you're ahead. Yeah. It's like, you're better off, obviously you're better off doing the right option, but the bad, okay option is better than nothing. Or flopping and then, you know, getting That was reversal. a full dash attack. Just hit him. <laughs> I think Kale's wisened up to the, um, the sort of like late nares on the shield. They don't really do anything unless you like let them, right? No, oh, late nares, like, you, you think he's like... Like, the, like short hop nares on, like, when, they, when like, the Falcon's above you, you sort of short hop nair, and it's like, it's very negative, I'm assuming, oh. right? I'm trying to think of, like, exactly... Oh, whoa, okay. She was holding out. That was... Yeah, that happened to me a lot. Ah, okay. I was expecting to see... I was waiting to see what, nice. like, he did to punish that RP, but kind of misses it, but... That's a better punish. Mm. Oh, that could be a shield grab, but Caleb just yeah. respecting the shield pressure. That's the thing, if you have confident shield pressure, you can get away with, like, messing up a few times, because... Yeah, they cool. can't, like... You get you condition a person to respect your shield pressure, then, you know, that's huge. Oh, and suddenly, I... This was... I was 100 riding this off, but this is... It's still iffy. And, I mean, yeah. Is, uh, she knows the wrong move, but, yeah. There was some hope. If you get a grab at like a zero, you, you get like a lot of it. It's been a good set. Uh, yeah. You think we're going? I feel like we're going even battle for the dreamline. Um, uh, probably not battle. Feel what? 
Green light? Maybe? Can't even remember what the stages have been, to be honest. Uh, Cap one on. Cap one on Eva Battle. I can't remember where they played game one. Yeah, me neither. Uh, I feel like it was Battlefield. I feel like it was Battlefield game one. Um, Kale definitely won on Stadium. And Cap's won on. The thing is, Cap has the FD counter pick, but Kale's punish game is actually quite confident against floaties. I'd say yeah. like, he has like a decent idea of the float shot when there's no platforms. If platforms start getting in the way, it kind of messes up his um, you know, sort of float chart. But yeah, I stopped bottling around FD. <laughs> yes. To be fair, I think I rematched him still. Oh, hello, Kizza. What's up? Hope cool you're enjoying stuff. this, you know. We've got these two competent players right now. We've got um, when loses semis, when game four. This is actually a lot better than a lot of these sets usually go. <laughs> a lot of yeah, times, Gavin just kind of washes. Caleb, Caleb really wants this. Caleb uh, usually, there's usually one game where, like, Caleb comes reasonably close and then, like. Catherine's wins neutral like 50 times in a row. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And, like, the, like it's usually, like, the game after where Cap just does that and then. Yeah. It's like, alright, well. Okay, <laughs> that was, uh, he like, he was trying to pressure Cap from the Legend. He that just was did cool. a, like, down smash. Yeah. So he was trying to pressure, Caleb was trying to pressure Cap from the Legend. Um, he just did like these fadeaway bears, but he gave up way too much space. Yeah, that's like, what I mean. Like, not, like nothing Cap did there uh, was particularly like, no. splashy, but she just sort of knew where she had to be. Yep. And that can be a thing, like, it's, the mental game is so huge. Whereas if he was more comfortable, confident against like pressuring there, he yeah. may like say against say, someone like you. He would have need me and I would have died. <laughs> Okay. Good. Let's think. I think Captain was recognizing that Caleb was just kind of throwing out hitboxes and just yeah. in that spot you can be a lot more comfortable with just like putting out dash checks because they no longer think of shielding or like dashing away. They just like me Falcon mean. Oh, what the hell, Cap? <laughs> that was a <laughs> grab the ledge. That was like you know as I was saying before. Sometimes you just need to grab ledge hold L. Sometimes. Yeah, there's a lot of my set where I'm just sort of like at the ledge like shielding. I'm like. Why am I doing that? Oh, yeah. Yep. I think a big thing as well is like getting more comfortable holding ledge and recognizing when they can only go to ledge at that point. Because Peach can just sort of float out there, and once Falcon drops down like low enough to the point where he has to up B towards ledge and can't go to stage, you can just yeah. grab ledge immediately. Whereas Catherine just wants to put herself in that position and then just put out a bear whenever. Oh, no, don't. Was... Epic DI. I promise she was, holding, she was holding in on everything for the last up air, then she like held yep. out on that up air. And Classic. But yeah. We've all done that at times, but... Okay. <laughs> I like the, the, uh, the dash to make the uh, buffer roll read. Yeah. <laughs> appreciate that. Oh, damn. She, that okay. was a lot of confidence. I'm pretty she, sure that was an accident. The accident, like. the accident will turn up, you think? Oh, I mean, I do it. Like, yeah. so I, I just pack in this mash and it comes out. I'm like, okay. Fair enough, fair enough. But I think it may not have been. So, Catherine, there was, there was a few dash tags there where, like, Catherine just throws out on shield and then Caleb doesn't, like, shield grab. Yeah, it's, I, it's... Oh. Sorry, what were you going to say? Uh, it's just like one of those things where it's like you see a shield and it's like going smaller and you're like, BAM! And it's just, it's like, it's just like the worst, but you just... So, assuming platforms don't mess up with like sound, you down for an E or whatever, down for an E actually isn't true. Yeah. Um, you have a few frames to add all jail. Um, I've still been too lazy to actually like practice that, but... Caffin is as well. So, that, nice. down for an E will definitely work on um, Caff. And that's not even, you know, sort of like... Coaching with like everyone knows, Gabe knows it, Catherine knows it. Um, I'm glad of myself are really the only features yeah. in SA that would say. Who was like, oh, okay. With the new Uncle Punch, it's like, yeah. I haven't really looked into it, but it seems like it could like set that up be much uh, easier, right? I think it's probably easy to do it in 20XX. I thought, oh, okay, okay. I think it's easy, you can set up just a safe state, because it's like really awkward to like, there is no like, Falcon doing down throw knee on you and like Uncle Punch, okay. right? So, so you like, can't I don't know about the new one if it's like easy to set up safe stage. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I haven't actually touched the Me neither. That's yeah. why I was asking. Yeah. Um, okay. You can definitely set it up in 20XX though. You can set up yeah. like... Okay. Interesting. Yeah, okay, yeah. All right. I was like, what's she going to do? And I was like, well, this should be it. Ah, uh, I think... Monster Cap could come for knee. He went for up there. Okay, up needs a grab. At yep. zero. Inside to up airs. Captain Cap just wants a nail. Um, yeah. Nail fair right now. Yeah, smash. Yeah, yeah. catches him out. That was, a, yeah, that was a good set. Yeah, it was. A, it was a, I think that was definitely like. Catherine just didn't have free reign of it. No. That's it. It's, it's getting closer. Catherine, you know. Uh, I don't know if like. Yeah. yeah. I, you can't really like quantify exactly what like it was, but. It's improvement. Yeah, That's what yeah, it's yeah. It's see. like 
She didn't have free reign, but she still was allowed to do pretty fraudulent stuff. She was still reasonably comfortable in the situation. Yeah. There were definitely spots where she was just like, knew exactly what 